This is a true story. I was born and raised in Israel, the most militarized country in the world. I live in Singapore, the second most militarized country in the world, and I studied in the US, the country with the biggest military in the world. It's all about military. The military is a big part of my life, and I get it. Every country needs one. That's what I thought until I landed in a place that has no military. And what I found there made me happy. And I think it'll make you happy. This is the story of the small island nation of Grenada. Welcome to Grenada! It is one of very few countries in the world that decided to let go of their army. You think this country must be unsafe because of that, but it's not. Even if it has no army, Grenada turns out to be one of the safest countries. It has very low crime. It's so safe here, I haven't locked my door since 2016. No army! And in fact, the police How you doing, guys? walk around with no guns. No army! And all the army money they invested in the country. Instead of army bases, they have beaches. The main source of money is tourism, so they develop really beautiful beaches and really beautiful nature. Welcome to Grenada! This development is what they spend money on. Welcome to Grenada! Instead of aircraft carriers, they have yachts and cruise ships. Tourists flock to this island to get a bit of beach and a bit of sun. Grenada! And instead of grenades, the country of Grenada has cocoa. The country invested in its chocolate production. So now they produce really good chocolate and export all over the world. Welcome to Grenada! And last but not least, education. This tiny island is home to one of the best universities for medicine, with thousands of students flying here to study and become doctors. No army! <sighs> Don't get me wrong, Grenada has many problems. It is definitely not perfect. And I don't hate the military. In fact, I love the military. Without it, I don't think I would be alive and this video would not exist. But secretly, I wish we didn't need it. Just like every soldier, I wish we don't need to have an army or go to war because nobody likes war. But if you're wondering how a world with no army may look like, well, it'll look something like Grenada. Like this, this, and this. And that's not a bad place to live in.